I greet you all in the name of scouting. My name is Agid Bambaga, and my scouting journey began when I was six years old. Scouting gave me the opportunity to step out and get involved in outdoor activities and games, but also I made lots of friends. Born and raised in a remote village in eastern Uganda, I was involved at a very young age in heavy hard activities like goat keeping, coffee harvesting at my family plantation, and also carrying heavy water containers in search for safe, clean water. I got my first international experience at Kandersteg International Scout Center. I applied as a pinky and I got financial support and also the opportunity to volunteer. One tricky challenge was the Swiss weather, <laughs> but I found a solution when I put on several scout pink uniforms <laughs> and sweaters on me. When my international experience ended at KISK, I got my backpack on, full of skills, and went back straight to my coffee plantation and general duties. I grow coffee, and not only does it support my family, but also it's a gateway to communities through education, food, and shelter. I'm here to share with you two of our scout projects that we are doing. One of these projects is Scouts for Safe Water. In this project, I and the scouts have involved the young scouts, the scout leaders, and the community leaders to engage and sensitize families, scout groups, schools, and communities about clean and safe water. To date, I'm happy to say 23,000 people from 15 villages and slums across Uganda have access to clean and safe water with the water filters and boreholes that we have donated. This includes one primary school. Talking about primary schools, education is a human right. It is a gateway where people can access information, where there can be less inequalities, but also sustainable development. Up to today, children in less privileged communities like mine still walk over six kilometers to and from school. And this has caused them to miss school, sometimes get kidnapped or raped. I and the scouts are not keeping silent on this. And we are beginning the first scout leaning school in Eastern Uganda. And in this school, we hope that the young people will be able to get more scouting activities and programs, but also end up responsible citizens. I and the local scouts, with the international connections that I made while at Kandersteg, are now making bricks and also doing skilled non-skilled work alongside the professional builders to build this school. Now we are one simple example of how impactful scouts can be in their communities. 
imagine the collective impact that we can make in the world. Thank you for being change movers and champions of hope.